see the road and you stay focused. Trust me, bro. Having having a live stream live while you're driving, you're not going to be focused. You you you're just not. Here's a here's one of the good ones. Ricky Too Clean says, "Yo, bro, what's the sense of going live if you can't interact?" Just make videos like you used to. Exactly. Exactly. That's what being live is about. Live is the engagement. Live is the interactions. I mean, I I get some, you know, I see some drivers that do go live and don't, you know, don't say nothing at all or just talk or whatever, whatever. But that's what it is. It's the engagement. It's the engagement because when you see the comments, when you see the comments, then you're engaging, meaning you're not focused. You're not being focused because your mind is always going to be on the attention of the live feed. Huh? I wonder what's, I wonder what they saying in the chat. Let me, let me just take two seconds because that's all it takes to see what's going on in the chat and then come back into an incident or accident or worse, or you might end up being in the ditch. Let me also tell you something about live feed, right? Let me, let me tell you something. Let me, hold on. Let me tell you something. See, if you get into an accident, the state trooper that's going to come out and investigate the accident they're going to take everything in consideration. Everything in consideration. Now, mind you, you might at that time, might have been paying attention to that live feed, but when the person that you crash into or whatever the case they going to use that information against you, brother. They're going to use that against you, my G. Listen to what I'm saying. And a lot of you guys that's coming in here say I'm hating. Y'all y'all can say whatever y'all want. I'm, I'm talking from a safety point of view, bro. I'm one of them real truckers. All right. I'm not. I'm yes. I'm a YouTuber, but. I'm not doing this for YouTube. Again, YouTube is not paying me. All right? I'm just saying. But when they take everything in consideration, guess who's going to be in the wrong? You could be in the right all day. You could be in the right. You could, you know, you could be like, I, ain't, I, I wasn't paying attention to my live feed. I was, I'm, I'm, I was focused on the road, but your live feed was going though. And when the prosecutor or the the family lawyer gets a hold of that video, you're done. Your company's done. That's it. No more. I like your channel too much for you to do this. This is a bad, bad idea. If trucking is really important to you, then you shouldn't allow a bunch of people who aren't taking any kind of risk push you to take risks that jeopardize your job and your CDLs. Yes, sir. CDLs. You will be jeopardizing them because once you get into an accident, your CDL career is over. It's over. I got to find that. Over. Anyway, I want to feel, I want to feel, I want to feel bad. Oh, I want to feel bad for misfortunes that comes your way. But at this point, bro, you are directly inviting it. Yes, you are. Yes. Yes, you are. I love your attitude and inspirational character, but this 100% makes it look like you're in it for media clout. 
This is his words. This is Dallas Roberts words, not mine. And he's 100. He's 100. But there's a comment up under his comment that says he's a hater for saying it. But you got to hear it, though. You don't want to turn around and just hear, oh, well, go ahead. Yeah, yeah, go ahead. Go ahead. You, you, you need somebody like Dallas Roberts to come in and hit you with the real. You need somebody like that, man. Because everybody in this comment session is telling you to do it, do it, do it. They don't, they're not risking anything. They're not. They're not risking anything at all, bro. You have lots to you you have lots to lose. You have your life, your career, your CDL, and everything else. So are you the breadwinner for your family? If that's the case, then you're done. How you gonna how you gonna breadwin up in the up in the hospital, bruh? How you gonna breadwin when you sit feet underground because you wanted to live stream while driving, not building a career in trucking. Facts. Please consider this and stay safe on the road, man. I look forward to seeing more of you and your uploads. Try to stay within the boundaries until you master the road and maybe reach out to some other trucking vlogs, guys. They probably have valuable insight. Yes, sir. Lockout Man Podcast Show, where the best conversations starts over here on the Lockout Man Podcast Show. I'm not just telling you things that what I think. I'm not just jawjacking. I'm not jealous, as one as one commenter says in my live feed about a day ago. I am not jealous, bro. I am happy for you. I am extremely happy for you. I'm happy for you on all accounts. I'm happy for you that you got, you know, that you're trying to learn this industry, which you need to learn more of. I'm happy for you for your content that you need to learn from. And I'm happy for your channel that you're that you're actually growing. That you actually growing, man. And then when you get to a point, then maybe you can be inspiring, inspirational, uh, an influencer of sorts. All right. So no, no jealousy over here, bro. Just just real conversation, because that's what we do here on the Lockout Man podcast show. You know, again, the best conversations starts over here on the lockout man podcast show here's another one bw bwoolno comments remember people he will not be commenting it will be just like a dash cam only live it doesn't bro it it doesn't matter if he's not commenting or not the fact that he's live streaming is the issue here. A da yeah, dash cam is totally different. But I can tell you, you know what? You want to know who actually have uh, live streaming in their trucks? Company trucks that has uh, forward and rear facing dash cams. Now, don't get me wrong. Some people will say that. It only records only an incident, but go back to the conversation that I had with the guy over at Litex. Companies can live stream, uh, can stream in real time and see exactly what you're doing in real time. And that's what company with forward facing and rear facing cameras. So one day you probably might be live streaming and everything and then you say that you're not going to say nothing, but a comment comes across your screen that that tips on the mind and you happen to, hey, uh, such and such. Yeah, such and such. I'm driving up in Montana right now. And suppose that suppose the company camera was streaming at that time. 
they could pull him. They could pull him over and say, "Hey, bro, um, who are you talking to?" And you try to be like, "Oh, I'm talking to myself." <laughs> no, 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 no. You're you you you're responding. You're responding to somebody, bro. And then boom, you lost your job because of it. Z O Z O F F I says, "So, bro, you want to live stream driving?" Bro, don't you know we can literally get in our cars and see the same damn thing? <laughs> oh, man, the commenters in your comment session, bro. Oh, man, Sasha. Uh, Fementa. I can't pronounce your name, but man, you 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 just came back with a good one. You you just came back with a good one. And this and on your and on your comment, I'm going to wrap it up on this note. You said for me, I think it's a bad idea for now. You know, an accident can happen on you in just a couple of seconds. It only takes two seconds. No! That's all it takes. And plus, you are a new driver. My opinion is to stay focused and leave any distractions. Please, for now, please don't listen to any of these commenters that says do it. And that's it on the Lockout Man podcast show, man. Bobby, Bobby, my man, Bobby Reach, you are trending right now, bro. You are trending right now. You you trending on topics, man. So again, shout out to you, bro. Like I said, this ain't no, this ain't no hate, no jealousy, no nothing, bro. I want to see you succeed, man. I really do. I honestly do want to see you succeed in this trucking game if this is what you want. But again, like I said when I opened up the episode. Go check out my guys, man. Check out Big Jai over, you know, over on YouTube. El Haji TV. Um, what's the other guy? Flets. Check out Flets. Check out Cali Scott. Check out check out all those YouTubers over there that's 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 doing well, making bank, and being uh and and doing a lot of things in media, which I think that's the route where you want to be. But check them out, bro. Check them out, man, because I think you will really fit in that uh in that category over there, man. I really do. I really do think that you will fit in that category over there of making good YouTube content that, you know, that makes people laugh, cry, or whatever the case. All right? As far as trucking goes, I mean, that's just my opinion. You know what I'm saying? All of us got one, <laughs> you know, all of us got one. A lot of you guys in the chat might not agree, you know, might not agree or disagree, but that's what it is. We're all human. That's what we got. You know, we we are blessed with our own minds, our own opinions and whatever else. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? But Bobby, man, much success to you, bro. Um, I did get your email. But I tell you what, if you want to holler at me, bro, there's ways to get at me. You got my email. Uh, and if you want the if you want the podcast to happen, I'm I'm all for it. But you got to reach out to me, bro. I, I already I already did my thing. <laughs> I already did my thing. It's you know already already flinged out the 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 the, the catch it's, it's up to you to snag on to it and make it happen bro all right all right lockout man podcast show where the best conversation starts over here on the lockout man podcast show i really do appreciate it if you guys want to come on the show share some videos some comments uh or whatever you guys want to share Hit me up in the text. That's 216-600-2090. 
Let me know what you got and we'll bring it on and make it happen. Until next time, everybody, y'all take it easy and stay safe out there. Peace.